Hello, everybody. Hello. Welcome to CCL Season 53 first round match between Agent Scarn, never heard of him, with High Elves, and Durfell15, might have heard of him, with um, Wood Elves. And in the booth is Kalon and Hancock. Hello. Hello. Uh, thanks very much for having us. Uh, welcome along, YouTube. Hello. Uh, welcome to another great game from the round of 64 from season 53, as Jim already said. Uh, yeah, Durfel uh, has been in the cup before. Uh, Uber Duffel is uh, his name in, chat, in Twitch. Ah. Yeah, yeah nice, the last nice round of 64. Whatever. Yeah, last round of 64. Yeah. Just for Blubble Sag. Too, in Blubble too, yeah. Yes, that's true, isn't it? Yeah. Yep. It may not be the last ever chalice, but it is the last ever no. round of 64. Already mm -hmm. qualified for this one, Kitty. Four. Yeah, you have. That's a lovely necro team you have. Mm -hmm. Shame if something was to happen to it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, chalice round one. Yeah. And Elfoff again, here we go. Yeah, pretty exciting. Uh, Durf is pretty good, I think. Uh, seen him play a bunch of different stuff. Militant Vegetarianism is a pretty hilarious name for a team as well. It's a brilliant yeah, Militant Vegetarianism. Yep. Fantastic name. Mm. I um I think I've played this agent Scott. I think he's quite new. I'm not sure if he's an alt or something. Cause he's he's not bad. He's a decent player. Cool. So it should should be a fun game then. Yeah, it should be it should be okay. Yeah, I really don't like this. Uh... Well, I was gonna say I don't really like a frenzy, a frenzy jugs that much, but I really yeah. hate one when he's movement six. <laughs> Is he double bust? Yeah, he's double move bust. Yeah, he, he's not niggled at least because we did look it up. He's only one SPP off getting move up, so you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nice dancer, isn't it? And uh, some guys. Yeah, that's a lovely dancer. And to be fair, I mean, you know, it's very difficult to get rid of that other fella with the um, with all of the cool skills that he does have, right? I mean, that's trip. It's double doubles. So yeah, I, I really like the mighty, mighty blow, and I really like the jugs and the frenzy. Not so much. But I suppose it's handy for the um, uh, DACA. We see uh, Miss Bell Tree uses it an awful lot and uh, it works out quite well for her. So, you know, there's a, it's, a, it's a school of thought. Yep. Whew. Pretty rowdy Wundy. Pretty rowdy. I wonder if it's just a mistake. Mm. And I know he's all the way down the back and he's miles away from stuff, but like, it would help. So, yeah. Yeah, it'd be interesting. Like, he could just come with a little bit. Uh, yeah, like a skull there, and he could have just come straight through the middle, right? <laughs> I've yeah. done that loads, Jim. <laughs> Mighty Blow is doing things, though. And, uh, yeah, although although hilariously, he's not much of a threat, what with him being uh, only move six. So he can't, he can't, he can make a hole, but he can't take advantage of it. <laughs> I'm just laughing at Timmy, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I have a yeah, I've, yeah, cool. Oh, dear me. <laughs> yep, yep, that's what I said, King Boo. Yep. <clears throat> He's a funny man. <laughs> well, we've got a big scrap going on a little box. Oh god. Are we trying like can we can we try to get our phrasing a bit better? I didn't mean okay. to say that. Uh, you sure no, I didn't mean to say he found a hole and didn't make any use of it as well, but we're just terrible. We're just terrible human beings. Yep. On purpose. Freudian slips, left, right, and center. Mm -hmm. Oh god! The best one was when, when, when the raid from Elliot and Nikki Chan and I said rail <laughs> instead of rail. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the rail, Nikki Chan. <laughs> nice. Oh, God. It, it'd be, it's so embarrassing when you're, especially when you're on the internet and you say something wrong and people take you up the wrong way. Oh, hey. Yep. So, 
Um, yeah, just fighting in the middle. Yeah, interesting, right? Because you would like to get you would like to get some penetration and uh, put a bit of pressure on. <laughs> you would. Do you know, yeah. first on your mind in this type of game is uh, how do I get you know some decent penetration. Uh, he was lucky the the uh, the tree went uh, let's say went stupid. The tree uh, uh, rooted fairly early on, so. Uh, to be fair, Durfil's managing to make a um, a really good use of it, despite the fact that it's not uh, uh, able to move around the place. Yeah. Yeah, pressure uh, the yes, rear, it, exactly. Yeah, to pressure the rear. So he's keeping himself nicely out of range and uh, going to be able to get some stuff away. But um, yeah, he's going to he's going to find it difficult to get through this, and um, it's turned into something of a half daka, right? Hmm, a little bit. He's mm. to Daniel Beddingfield this, doesn't he? He does, <laughs> yeah. I, I thought exactly the same when he said it. <laughs> it jumped to my head straight away. I gotta get through, <laughs> yeah. isn't it? Yeah. It's funny, I gotta isn't get through it? it. It is, it's great. It must be just being a certain age. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's GFI <laughs> because he's fucking movement six. <laughs> 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 it's the thing it's the because uh, i remember when we were doing the uh oh and if you haven't watched it anybody on youtube do go and watch the uh uh the draw where we went through all of the different cups and uh, all of the different teams in the cup mm. and how they were all getting on and uh i did call out that uh, i was looking forward to seeing that dancer have to do gfis because of his frenzy yeah and he did almost instantly yeah i mean he's been good so far he's managed to get He's blitzing with him every turn, um, but he has man and he managed to get two stuns so far. So um, that's something at least. Uh, <clears throat> ooh, this is the transfer. Ooh, oh. The past as well. The past, yeah. the catch, the potato. Us, thanks to the. I love the visual. The, the, the visual sound. <laughs> I love the audio sound mm. of the uh, catch triggering. I really like that. And this is it's the same. It's the click when uh, tackle goes as well. Mm. It's those little auditory, auditory experiences that we're missing in the new game, right? Yes, that's very correct. It's kind of one of the reasons that it lacks a sense of responsiveness is that there isn't any kind of additional trigger on something. Exactly. And, I mean, it's bad enough that there's no, like, um, you know, touchdown animations and stuff like that. But um, And it's a lot better uh, than it was in, well, the first beta, I suppose, when, you know, you just dodged through guys and they didn't even bother looking at you as you dodged past them. Yeah. So at least they're making moves it's now. It's impossible to sack the ball, though. Yeah, I didn't like this. This should have been one over, right? This should have been one over, and this one over, and then and then makes it a lot harder to get through instead of just going through on twos. Mm -hmm. He does go through on twos and sack the ball. Yep. He does indeed. There's got an edge five, fella. Pretty great edge five, isn't it? Hmm. Did the edge five, edge five run out of movement then? Yeah, he had to stand up. Ah, oh, oh, he stood up, did he? I couldn't see. The, the quality's really bad in this game. Yeah, like... it's terrible, yeah. yeah. Sorry, guys. It's okay, it's don't worry about it. Well, it is. You could get nitro and then it wouldn't be I've bad. I've got nitro. He's got Are you nitro. serious? Yeah. Wow. Well. Maybe we have to have nitro, is that what it is? <laughs> uh, no, it should, it should just be me having it. Yeah. So, um, Agent left a, uh, a very complicated sack on a ball, and <laughs> Uber the Fells. No, is it? Yeah, Uber the Fells yep. managed to get yeah. He has indeed. Yeah. Yeah, it was, that was really, this was just what, one over, wasn't it? Like, you know, I, I knew he, mm -hmm. like, made this screen, but if he moves it one over, it's like a double screen, isn't it, kind of thing. It's, it's just way yeah. better. He's on a catcher, but it's on double guard, so uh, he, he's got a 1D off the ground if he wants, but... But shit, trying to hit a blood stepper. Right, this guy one can day. come through, can't he? Put him on the mm. three. Or I'll run all the way around. Oh, okay. Yeah, I might cool. have just come through on the three in here. Yeah. He gets him on the second go. Sidestep, though. Oh. Ooh. Ouch. Uh, soy boy. <laughs> um, okay. So he's not in range, though. Uh, does he send the, 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 the guard through, I wonder? I mean, he so should he's do gonna, it at some point. He should do it at some point, yeah. So he has to send the guard through now. 
just even behind the dancer, that square, who no, it comes all the way through. It's not really yeah, doing a lot, is it? <laughs> doesn't, doesn't really do anything now. Mm. I think yeah. I could see a sack of the ball again. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, he's done with the frenzy He's done dancer. with a frenzy trope. Oh, yeah. He decided to go with a frenzy trope. Yeah. But gets the... Uh... Just, just, just get him down first time, it's fine. Wow. Yeah. Don't like frenzy traps, but... Work uh, for no. Else. Uh, yeah, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> it's funny the amount of times that we've gone. Oh, this is a frenzy trap, and it's not mattered at all. Yeah, but yeah, well, it usually doesn't, does it? That's the thing. Yeah, I suppose. Yep. Yeah. You know, like if if somebody made a pointless one in thirty six every turn, it usually wouldn't matter. <laughs> yeah, for sure. And that's less likely than the than a frenzy trap might be. Mhm. Mm yeah, I mean, most things that have frenzy, it's it's a it's a skill that you're giving them kind of laid in, so they already have all of the other skills. Ooh. Yep. But the ball has indeed fucked the fuck off to the other side of the pitch. So. Wow. Wow. Okay. I mean, that's a pretty good result for. Uh, yeah. For Durful. Durful, yeah. Yeah, Wizgon is pretty great. <clears throat> And, uh, yeah, just has to stay back. Uh, I suppose you just try to pick on the relay guys here, um, depending on how the things look at the end of the half, or at the end of the uh, turn. Um, it's pretty annoying now to be down two catchers. It's a lot, of your, a lot of your movement gone. It's funny, isn't it? Because Uber DeFell, I never, I never thought of saying Uber Durfel. <laughs> But yeah, then, indeed. Yeah, but then Durfel just screams Durfel rather than it does. <laughs> Yeah, that's super interesting, isn't it? <laughs> it is not super interesting, Jim. Do you want to tell it again? No. Okay. You know, it's not the Swarm Lord, is it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. no. Nothing is. Nothing is. Yeah. Fuck Lentils. I'm glad he's fucking dead. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, glad most when most of this team dies. To be fair, and uh, yes, Nick Lovitz, the, the team is hilarious. It's militant vegetarians. <laughs> a great name, isn't it? It is a really great name, yeah. Uh, lentils always remind me of the young ones. Mm. Oh, guys! Neil from the young ones, who, um, it was. What was his name? Uh, Sky Blue Monty pointed out that Rick looks exactly like Neil from the Young Ones, <laughs> and he really does. Yeah. yeah, it's hilarious, and he says stuff like that as well. He's like, "Hmm, uh, yeah, guys," and you're like, "Oh wow!" <laughs> yeah. There's a couple of times he says things, and you're like, "That's fucking fantastic." Yeah. yeah. Do you know what? When I saw Lentil, I just thought, you know, like how Kano makes his teams, and a lot of other people make names his teams like that about, you know, like a pun and a theme. Mm. I just mm. thought you could have like food tennis players and have Eve, Ivan Lentil. <laughs> uh, no, I don't get it. Who's who's the Lentil person? Or Ivan Lentil was a football. Player. Oh, or Ivan. Oh, Lentil. it's football. I don't know if it's Ivan, even. No, it's not, not 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 football. Tennis, tennis. Oh, okay. He was very good, but he never won one. Cool. Well, there was a McEnroe reference last week on one of the chats. Was it on here? What was that? Something hilarious. No, it wasn't on here. Are they something? Yay! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, like this, he gets to do the touchdown. Yep. Thanks, Kaboom! Nice. Yeah, he was really good. <laughs> yeah, the wizard was great, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I don't know if it was right, but I don't hate it. Nerf passing. Yeah, don't worry, Magic Out. Your dream has come true. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, the more, that, the more that I play Blood Bowl 2020, which is about, you know, 15 games, mm -hmm. the more I fucking hate the passing change. Yep. Super interesting. Yeah, it's just frustrating. Oh, it's frustrating, that is. Mm. <laughs> Diddle is the McEnroe d and yeah. <laughs> if you had a cock dice... Ah, uh, that was it. 
fine. <laughs> yes, that was it. It was Jimmy, or it was Dimmy calling Dadle the Mac and Row of D and D. That was exactly the joke. Mm. And Dimmy is the Pete Sampras and the Andy Murray <laughs> and the uh, somebody else, Rafa Nadal of, uh, of axe <laughs> axe wielding. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't get an answer last week. What does he have a name for the axe? Uh, well, it is is two little axes or Hancocks, but I, don't know I know they're the Hancocks. Yeah, is the big does the big axe have a name, Dim? I don't like the emphasis on the little. <laughs> yeah, you should call it the Kalon. Then you've got the big one as the Kalon. <laughs> <laughs> then you can raise the Kalon. <laughs> oh, beautiful! <laughs> you could have, oh, quick snap! Right, you could get the one turn here. <clears throat> and I am a large man. Next time we see you, Kalon, we're going to compare dicks. Okay. <laughs> so, um, yeah, sounds good. Oh, we should have moved this guy down and this one across. Chopper, Kalon. Oh, no, because he wants to eat him there for that hit, yeah. The film, you know, it. Uh, it was, it was Dim said. Yeah. It's me, Chopper. It's me, Chopper. There's a fucking a Father Ted thing where he's like, uh, he calls his a rabbit uh, uh, Sampras. And he's like, why'd you call him Sampras? And he's like, well, you know, tennis, rabbits. That whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> he should have blitzed, like, shouldn't oh, he? Okay. Should have blitz. Shouldn't he have just made a blitz with this guy somehow? Because he's got, he's got juggernaut frenzy. Probably should have made a blitz somehow. To use, you know, to use juggernaut. When you've got, when you're trying a one turn, you've got juggernaut. Should, should probably try and use it. Yep. I've compared dicks, but I haven't seen that. <laughs> With that new diet, then you'll see it soon, don't worry. Yeah, give your diet a couple more days. It'll work, <laughs> yeah, it'll work, it'll work its way through. <laughs> Sugar that mango and eat them out. <laughs> so funny though that he was talking through it. Like... Like it was actually part of his plan. <laughs> <laughs> like to start dieting two days, two days before he went to the event. <laughs> oh, uh, so good, so good. Oh, God. Oh, better look healthy for the lads. <laughs> <laughs> Time to start my diet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so good. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> I'm confident on how, on how thin he looks next time we see him. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Holy shit, to me, he lost weight! <laughs> <laughs> Positively spelt. <laughs> Well, one nil to Agent Scan. Uh, Durfo, I guess, can win on win on an overtime, right? I think yeah. he's that's gonna look rough though. He's already down four players. Yeah, he's um, he's taken a lot of bashing. Yeah, it's um, it, it's, it is, yeah. And it's, I mean, it's not like he can just kind of put it in either, you know. Stick it in. I think you probably should just hit on the hit with the tree on the LOS, right? Try and get in mighty glow room. Yeah, I thought hit on the tree on the LOS. As far as it didn't. Mm. Mm. Mango just <laughs> limited by how much weight you can lose due to the, <laughs> due to the cost of mango juice. <laughs> <laughs> Slimmy G. Slimmy <laughs> G. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. Good job, Steve. Tim. Instead of mango drink, just buy one dragon fruit and just eat it. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, fruit isn't good anyway. For what? For losing weight. Well, it, it, it is because you're just eating fruit instead of eating anything else. That's the... fruit, fruit has sugar though, so fruit is pretty shit for losing weight. For sure. But, you know, it's, it's better than a shit. kebab, right? Well, it's better than a kebab, yes. But I mean, why yeah. isn't <laughs> Well, you know, we're talking about Demi, right? <laughs> oh. Yeah. Don't know why I can't lose weight. I had four kebabs, but then I, you know, balanced it <laughs> by having some pina coladas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Pina Coladas, we're gonna have Pina Coladas at Gym Con. Yeah. Whoa. Uh, I'm, I'm, I actually genuinely am getting a big uh, fear of missing out now. Oh, uh, don't blame me. It was all kind of real uh, when I uh, saw Nick um, in Elliot's stream earlier. It's just so cool, like, because um, it would have been so nice to have met the lads. But, you know, there's plenty of other opportunities. It's just a real shame because um, I'm missing G'day Nick, because obviously that's not likely to happen for another good while. Yeah, unless and I, uh, Nick and Skuro. And Skuro, yeah. Um, yeah, because I'm not going to America. <clears throat> I don't know, maybe there's going to be a really cool, um, if the World Cup was on in uh, in, in Australia, I might go. Mm, the World oh, Cup's on in America. Home. Yeah, I wouldn't go to America. Oh, okay. You'd go to Australia for the World Cup? Uh, I might, yeah. Goodness gracious. I don't think but they'd have was... it in Australia, would they? It's too shit. Uh, well, it depends on where it is, and it depends when it's on and everything else, you know, right? I mean, like, you know, they, they come over to Europe for it. I don't think they'll have the world. the football World Cup. What do you mean the rugby World Cup? I mean the Blood Bowl World Cup. Oh, oh the Blood Bowl yeah. World Cup. All oh, right, I thought you meant. Yeah, I thought you were talking about the World Cup, and then I was like, oh, I know you like rugby, yeah. so maybe you meant that. But you meant the Blood yeah. Bowl World Cup. Oh, yeah, the Blood yeah. Bowl World Cup. Yeah. Oh, oh that's unfortunate. Yeah, isn't it? Just this is looking like a mm. win for Agent Scarm. Yeah. It's certainly. He, he, um, he, I've just realised he's space cadet. Um, to fell, hasn't he? Yeah. R yeah. Repeated ball sacks left on. <laughs> yeah, it's been fully space converted. Fully space converted. Yeah, that's that's it, that's it, Steve. I just can't compete, you know. Mm. But it's good that there's going to be an Irish man there. And if the fact that he's going to, uh, yeah, an even more Irish man than I will be there is, it, it does, you know, fill me with some sucker. I'm so confused. I thought Skuru was Italian. He's banged on about being Italian. I'm just, what? Oh, but Irish he's from or... Boston. He's from Boston. Oh, right. Okay, okay. And obviously Boston is where yeah, all, yeah, yeah. all Irish people come from. Oh, yeah, yeah obviously. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The whole, um, how Americans view their... <laughs> yep. Their, their race or whatever is, is odd. Was it yeah, race? It... What would you call it? The nationality? Uh, I don't know. Ethnicity. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Thank you. Because they don't have a... Because um, they're all a hodgepodge. But it's all a, it's all a question Shucks. of... But it's mad because, well, like, in, in, in the UK... Oh, he got him, he got the, he got the GFI and he got the POW. Amazing movement, six frenzy. <laughs> <laughs> in the UK, like, regardless of what your previous background is, you just say British, right? Or, or, yeah, 100%, or yeah. Like, I mean, it, 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 it's a thing as well, though, right? I mean, like, Idris Elba is, is, like, fierce British, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but so is, like, you know... I mean, it, there's a part of me that kind of goes like he's probably more British than fucking Prince Charles, do you know? Because mm -hmm. um, he's German, right? <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. Yeah. So it's just kind of weird. There's like little things in your head like that. But I suppose that's the thing, right? It's the whole, you know, bring me your tired, your poor, your weak. And, uh, you know, America being kind of made up as a hodgepodge of various different people. And uh, because they don't really have a huge amount of history themselves, uh, being able to... Uh, view themselves through that lens of uh, where their ancestry comes from is massively important to them. The really sinister part about it is that the majority of the information that comes out about where people are from is all from Ancestry.com and the like, which is um, uh, mostly organized by uh, Mormons. So, uh, yeah. Mm, Explain why, why, what's, wrong, what's wrong or all right with that. Uh, well, so the purpose of it, so uh, the Mormons in Utah have a really well... Uh, <clears throat> well uh, educated uh, retired force of people who um, so they used to work and they're no longer working so part of your uh, thing that you do for the uh, for society is you go and um, he has to pick this up Why yeah, pick yeah it, up? it was such an easy pick up right you just go it was one, so two, easy. three, it's just four, a, five yeah, and then you go. exactly had to pick that up mm. um, so yeah they uh, they are able to uh, ooh, Ooh, did the three fails the twos? Brilliant player, not picking it up. Gets wow, a pass. he's full space oh, cadet at him. Full <laughs> space yeah, he didn't do the twos out. He did. He did. He tried to do threes. Was yeah. it twos? Yeah. Oh threes. no, it was, it was threes either way. Yeah, cool. Mm. Sorry, I beg your pardon. Um. 
uh, yeah, so uh, they get the Mormons to uh, find out where everybody is from. They get to uh, work out where all people are. They organize uh, where they are from their ancestry, and then they baptize into the Mormon faith. Uh huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. They got in trouble for uh, doing it. <laughs> yeah, I'll stop talking about it, actually. Thanks. Yeah, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> It's good uh, to not say controversial things, isn't it? Yeah, of course, yeah. Uh, Vigenteb, uh, we don't like that joke, because uh, we've heard it five million times. So, um, but, but you're hilarious, well done. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I don't hate the joke, but it's not <laughs> the joke. Is, the joke is fine. But, yeah. I was giving out the uh, uh, Paravel for it, which uh, was my own silly uh, decision to decide to mention it to Paravel that it annoyed me. So now everywhere he goes, he sees me in chat and he's <laughs> like, oh, hey, Kayla, <laughs> which is exactly the right play. <laughs> yeah. Well, there you go. It was a pretty easy, pretty easy match for the High Hills, wasn't it? And that looked like a pretty yeah. tricky one for them. <clears throat> Got a yeah, lot of really levels and good Yeah, he just looks. banged on them pretty, pretty hard, didn't he? I mean, mm. there's not a lot left and... Um, yeah, just kind of, I don't know. Still weird plays. Like, I can't believe he didn't pick up that ball there. But then it just worked out for him because he won in nine. Yep. It is a it's... dice game at the end of the day. The Space yeah. Cadet with the ball was just phenomenal. Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, this was a master class in Space Cadetry. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> can he even put a in here, can he? He's not arsed. He's just giving the ball to that fella instead. Yeah. We might as well just fucking farm SPP. Yeah, lovely. Oh, yeah, yeah Durfle's still still playing the game though, which is nice to see. Yeah. Has Rick got his game? I think he's got his game started, isn't he, Rick? Uh, it was it was earlier on this evening. We don't know the result. Uh, it's not yet been streamed, but it was earlier on today, as was uh, Mr. Page. Mm. Did, have you watched the Mr. Page one yet? Uh, I have. I watched it live. Oh, I haven't we haven't watched it here though? That's what I was asking. No. Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. yes, yes. Sorry, I should have specified. Oh, the old uh, cheeky turn sixteen foul. Can't win it. Might as well kill one of the opposition players. Yeah, classic, classic strats. Mm. Boom. Boom headshot. That's what you get. Yeah. No tree fell. Hmm. Looks like we are getting a tree fell, are we? Oh no! Don't have anybody left. Get this guy uh, his remaining one SPP that he needs to uh, mm. to level for uh, open. Should have uh, should have attacked the defense this guy. Oh no, he's yeah, got, the defense yeah, no, guy was. I was going to say, right. I thought he had wrestle right. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, should have should have gone for the defense this guy mm -hmm. to increase the chances. It doesn't matter. Like it doesn't matter to him who he hurts, does it? Like uh, no, it does not. There you go. Congratulations, Agent Scan. <laughs> Commiserations, Durful15. Thank you very much, Kalon and Hancock. Being glorious having you in the booth. Thanks for having me. Thanks for having me. Four. And thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Oh, the, he got the MVP anyway, the, the slogan. Hey! <laughs> and uh, stay fantastic. Button mush.